Good morning, and we will begin our day with prayer. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The Father's glory, Christ our light, with love and mercy comes to span the vast abyss of sin between the God of holiness and man. Christ, yesterday and today, for all eternity the same, the image of our hidden God, eternal wisdom is his name. Glorious things are told of you, O city of God. On the holy mountain is his city, cherished by the Lord. The Lord prefers the gates of Zion to all Jacob's dwellings. Of you are told glorious things, O city of God. Babylon and Egypt I will count among those who know me. Philistia, Tyre, Ethiopia, these will be her children. And Zion shall be called mother, for all shall be her children. It is he, the Lord Most High, who gives each his place. In his register of peoples, he writes, these are her children, and while they dance, they will sing, in you all find their home. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end, amen. Glorious things are told of you, O city of God. Exalt the Lord our God, bow down before his holy mountain. The Lord is king, the peoples tremble. He is throned on the cherubim, the earthquakes. The Lord is great in Zion. He is supreme over all the peoples. Let him praise his name so terrible and great. He is holy, full of power. You are a king who loves what is right. You have established equity, justice and right. You have established them in Jacob. Exalt the Lord our God. Bow down before Zion his footstool. He, the Lord, is holy. Among his priests were Aaron and Moses. Among those who invoked his name was Samuel. They invoked the Lord and he answered. To them he spoke in the pillar of cloud. They did his will, they kept the law, which he, the Lord, had given them. O Lord our God, you answered them. For them you were a God who forgives, yet you punished all their offences. Exalt the Lord our God, bow down before his holy mountain, for the Lord our God is holy. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Exalt the Lord our God, bow down before his holy mountain. The scripture reading is from the first letter of St. Peter. Each one of you has received a special grace. So, like good stewards responsible for all these different graces of God, put yourselves at the service of another. If you are a speaker, speak in words which seem to come from God. If you are a helper, help as though every action was done at God's orders, so that in everything God may receive the glory through Jesus Christ, since to him alone belong all glory and power forever and ever. Amen. I called with all my heart, Lord, hear me. I will keep your commands. I called with all my heart, Lord, hear me. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. I called with all my heart, Lord, hear me. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation 
but deliver us from evil. We pause to offer our own special intentions. Almighty, ever-living God, shed the light of your glory on the peoples who are living in the shadow of death, as you did long ago, when our Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of Justice, came among us from on high, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. We ask God to bless you, to protect you, and to keep you safe throughout this day. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.